Hey again everyone, this is Paul with Paul's Railroad and I just wanted to show you my finished engine house that I designed and printed on my 3D printer. This is one of the many items that I will be doing for this railroad. I just wanted to show you what it looked like after it was finished being painted and put together and weathered. Now I want to do this first before I showed you all the build videos. So I know a lot of people aren't really interested in watching the build videos. They just want to see the end result. So here's the end result in all of our glory. I have installed micro LEDs into this engine house. And uh, I'll show you how to do that during the build of this engine house. Some of my build processes are not uh, the greatest. This is all new to me, this videoing. So I tape a lot of stuff. And I guess you can fast forward through if you don't want to watch it, but I'd rather have it and maybe that one person needs to see what I did and you don't need it, like I said, just skip ahead. Here you can see the interior of the engine house and the lights that I used. Again, I designed these lights to be somewhat similar to any type of light that you'd see in a shop setting. And all I used for the windows it's just some acetate and a magic marker to block some of the window out. So it looks like it's been painted over or broken glass. Again, I show you how I do all of that during my uh, build process videos. And as always, uh, I hope you like what you see. And if you do, please hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to tap that bell and give me a thumbs up too if you don't mind. It does help with the YouTube statistics, lets people see my videos. And uh, thanks again for spending your time with me and thanks for watching Paul's Railroad.